What's up guys? It's your girl M and I'm back with a video for you today. Oh my god, my battery is dying. I need to charge my battery. First of all, I'm just gonna show you guys how my groceries delivered. I spent like right around 200. I'm telling you, I used to spend 150. Okay, my camera died. So here we are. I got the groceries all put away. But what I was saying was it is getting way harder to stay within my 160 to 107, 150, 160, 170 budget. Like 170 was like, I'm, I'm cutting it off here at 170, but now it's like 180, 190. This one was 200, but that's because I kind of went out of a lot of things at once. Like I needed to get more basil, oregano, all those like little things that you don't have to get every grocery order. It seemed like I had to get like all of them. So I don't know. Um, inflation is just a B-I-T-C-H and I'm having to learn to deal with it. And I think I'm going to maybe amend my grocery shopping and see if I can get back to the 150, 160, 170. Cause I don't really want to be spending 189, $190, $200 on groceries. I really don't. I really don't. So anyways, um, before we get much further into this video, I just want to say from the bottom of my heart, how terrible I feel for the parents of those children and the two teachers who were taken from us yesterday. Uh, my heart goes out to that community here in Texas. It's like, I think it's about an hour from San Antonio. And my heart just, my heart breaks for the families and that that community especially because I heard it's a very it's a very small community and it takes a I, I don't I don't think you can back I don't it's not something that you can bounce back from because of how horrific it is but I just wanted to say that my thoughts and prayers are with that community and those families and I'm just I'm heartbroken for all of them and I just uh, I don't know, I, things gotta change. This happens too often in, to, to children who, it's bad enough happening to like high school students and middle schools, just elementary school students, they, they have no, they're just, it's all just, it's too much. And I just don't know. The government needs a kick in the ass. That's what I do know. A kick in the ass. Like that, we should not be having these traumas. These traumas just keep piling up. Like when is it gonna stop? When is it gonna stop? And I, I don't know where to go from here. All I know is that things need to change. And you know. How long ago did Sandy Hook happen? 10 years ago? And nothing's changed. And maybe if things had changed, I wouldn't be in this situation. So it's just terrible. I don't, I, I'm not gonna go into it anymore. I just, I just felt like I needed to say something because it's just so heartbreaking and there's not much else I can say. But, they're stable. Um, I'm gonna show you guys, this is a weird segue. I, I talk about something so sad and I'm like, hey, let's let's uh, talk about these cheesecake overnight oats that I made, like. It doesn't make any sense. It just doesn't make any sense. Anyways, I made these cheesecake overnight oats. We're just gonna power through this. Okay, um, I made these cheesecake overnight oats and let me like set you up right here. 
on my water bottle. Um, I'll link the uh, recipe in the description down below for you guys so you guys can see. I didn't have any strawberries, so I'm using I used blueberries. Look at that. It's supposed to be like blueberry cheesecake. We're gonna see. I saw it on TikTok, but I didn't save the recipe on TikTok. So I just like looked it up. But I'll post it. And then I have a graham cracker. There's like one lone graham cracker in this. I was supposed to make this a while ago, but I just kept like forgetting. And me and Vod ate all these graham crackers. So we're going to break this up and put it in on top and we're gonna see this is allegedly healthy allegedly healthy I don't know we'll see but yeah you guys are just gonna hang out with me today I'm doing laundry and cleaning downstairs and watching Frasier that's what I'm doing today Oh, the Chicago PD finale is tonight, but I won't be able to watch it till tomorrow because I have Peacock. So that's exciting. I wonder what happens because they left with a cliffhanger last night. Of course they did. Okay. I, I don't mind when they do like cliffhanger episodes, but I do mind when they do like cliffhangers and you're not gonna see the show, and then you've gotta wait months for it to come out again. I don't like that. I think that's very not cute. But I know, they gotta do what they gotta do. But okay. But um, if you don't know, like Chicago PD, Chicago PD exists in like the same universe. Okay, so Chicago PD, Chicago Men, and Chicago Fire are all like together. They exist in the same universe, and they also exist in the same universe as um, Law & Order SVU, Law & Order Criminal Intent, stuff like that, because, okay, so that's like, they're all by the same um, production company, Wolf Entertainment, so like the guy who created SVU and all that created the um, Ch one Chicago uh, series or whatever. I think Chicago Fire came first, and then it was Chicago PD, and then it was Chicago Med. I've never watched Med. I've watched some of Chicago Fire, but I've never watched uh, Med. Okay, let's try this. Let me shut up. got a piece with a graham cracker it's not bad it's very rich very very rich I'm gonna tell you this not gonna be able to finish it I'm I'm like struggling It's super rich. Let me get like some of the blueberries. Mm. It's good. But like I said, just super rich. It does taste like cheesecake. Kinda. handle something this sweet in the morning but I don't know maybe like maybe instead of this being like a breakfast maybe have it be like a snack or like have it some for breakfast have some for a snack
Like it does taste good, I'm not gonna lie, but. It's very rich. Very, very rich. Let me say that, I'll have Vaughn try it. But literally that's all I can eat of it. That's all I can eat of it. I need to make my coffee. So cheesecake, blueberry cheesecake, overnight oats. I don't know, it's a toss up. I don't know, pretty good, super rich. Would not be able to eat that for breakfast. It's like, what time is it? It's 2.09. Okay, I'm gonna make some coffee. Let me show you guys how I'm making my coffee. Well, for a today. I don't know. I just have to do random stuff around the house. Watch me just watch Frasier and not do anything. Watch. Just watch. All right, groceries. Um, I got one of those croissant pizzas and I'm gonna do a video on it because I wanna try it. I've been wanting to try them for so long so I'm definitely gonna do a video on that. Um, but yeah, groceries are put away. Looks very full in here. Let's make my coffee. As you know, this is my new favorite creamer. I will die for this creamer. I wanna be buried with this creamer. It's so good, but unfortunately, there's a little situation. They were out. So I am going to be trying the Dunkin' Extra Extra made with real cream and sugar, coffee creamer. So we're going to try that probably tomorrow. And I didn't get any fruit this grocery order. I got a lot of veggies. I didn't get any fruit because the fruit prices at H-E-B? Oh my God, they were insane. Like, I I got la my last grocery order. I got um, this like berry trio. It had like blueberries, raspberries, and blackberries. That was like $6. And it was not a lot of berries at all. But they only had like the huge thing of blueberries and like a smaller organic one but they were both like the same price and they were like five six bucks and i was like i'm not going to uh buy these blueberries because they're gonna go bad like i'm i'm not gonna use all these because i'm the one i'm the main one that eats the blueberries so i'm not gonna buy a bunch of blueberries and then have them go bad so i think i'm gonna go to trader joe's this week and get fruit at trader joe's um get bananas hopefully get blueberries maybe get some apples um and if they have strawberries the strawberries were expensive at H-E-B too so i was just like i'm not doing it i'm not doing it i'm going to trader joe's we'll get we'll get fruit there let's make this coffee i'm thirsty my camera kept dying but there's my coffee i've been sipping on it um and vaughn decided that he wanted to have the croissant pizza tonight for dinner so I think that's what we're going to have. Flaky and buttery layers of crust. So, we're going to try this pizza today. Um, I was going to give Abel a bath, but I need Vaughn. Because I want I want to film it for you guys. And I need Vaughn to like help me film it. But he has to do this thing for um, Call of Duty. He has to like unlock these guns for his stream. So, like, it's fine. Um, just give him a bath probably tomorrow or maybe later tonight mm, actually probably tomorrow so yeah we're gonna make this pizza and that's gonna be our dinner i'm gonna do laundry and then sweep down here but yeah just kind of a typical like regular day <sighs> i've just been on twitter like i've just been sad like i've just been this like it's hard to like just like go on you know what I'm saying and it feels weird vlogging like it feels weird like posting this video but like I gotta post a video I don't know it's just sad guys it's just really sad so I don't know I'm just feeling down feeling down in the dumps I think everybody is I think everybody is just feeling out of it because a lot of these tragedies that have been happening could have been 
prevented by uh, proper policies and you know changes and I don't know it's just like when is it gonna be enough you know what I'm saying when is it going to be enough hmm. okay this is what the pizza looks like this is on like a really old pan so don't judge me I put this in on the rack like I usually do pizza but um, it started to melt as you can see the pizza is done it start it started to like melt so I had to like quickly put this on here usually I would put foil but it is what it is so I'm gonna go ahead and slice this up and we're gonna try the DiGiorno croissant pizza all right we're trying this pizza Mm. It's nice and soft. You see the layers? You hear puppy paws in the background? Well, this is good. I don't know if it's like buy over other pizza is good but it's really good I like it I'm glad I got to experience it I don't know if I'll like buy it regularly because it is more expensive than like a regular frozen pizza so maybe just once in a while but I like it it's good but I think it's good to try once but I wouldn't like reach for this again maybe every blue moon like if I was craving it but it's just it's I mean it's good but I'm you can save your money <laughs> because I know it is more expensive it's more expensive than just a regular DiGiorno rising crust it's a couple dollars more so, I don't know. I mean, it's pizza. Pretty hard to mess up pizza. I have my headphones on because Lana's streaming. Um, but that's going to do it for this video. It's kind of all over the place. Um, I am going to be making a cup of cup of cake. So you're gonna see that video tomorrow because I'm gonna make it tonight. It sounds so delicious. I'm not making it till later. So um, it's not why it's not in this video. So I'm making a cup of cupcake. And yeah, I got my laundry going. I'm probably gonna take a nice long shower because tomorrow I'm going to be showering this beast that is on the couch. If you know, you know. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm sorry, it's just weird energy today. You know, with everything going on, it felt weird to like post a video, but it also felt weird not posting a video because I do want to be more consistent over here. So, sorry if the vibes are off. I think everybody's vibes are off. Um, but yeah, I love you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Hug your loved ones. Keep them close. Hug them tight. Um, and once again, sending my thoughts and prayers and my love and God's comfort to all the families uh, that were affected by what transpired yesterday. So um, that's it. Uh, be sure to follow my Instagram at Midwest Mansfield and my Twitter at MMAN. And on my Twitter, actually, I've retweeted some um, different. Uh, resources for if um for donating to the families and um uh just people the families and just like different things um on my twitter so go check that out i uh, love you guys and i will see you tomorrow with a cup of cake with a cup of cake